next, how good is this? A matchup for the UFC welterweight division title. All right, so here he is, the number one welterweight contender, getting set to challenge for the UFC's 170-pound title. Took a long winning streak in many years for him to realize this opportunity. He is not taking it lightly. He has said all here during fight week he's appreciative of this opportunity, but he is confident he is going to maximize it and leave as not just a contender, but a UFC champion. As he makes his way towards his cage, he believes this is his time. He believes he is destined to take this title. His preparation for this bout has gone absolutely according to plan. He's in fantastic shape with a great game plan, and he expects to walk out of this cage tonight as the new champion. He is the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC welterweight champion in a division full of killers. He has remained the hunted at 170 pounds. Now, unquestionably staring at his toughest challenger to date, can he go back home as the champion? If he can, another chapter to one of the greatest welterweight legacies the Octagon has ever seen. The champion is in focus. He is in his prime. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this camp has been absolutely spectacular. He believes he has a solid game plan, and his mentality coming into this fight is clear and focused. Or till the date for this, our main event of the evening. Woodley is 13 years the elder. He will have a one-inch reach advantage. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Welterweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 156 pounds. Fighting out of Nagoya, Japan, presenting the challenger, Allen. And now we can see the champion fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 18 wins, 3 losses, and 1 draw. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of St. Louis, Missouri, USA, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Tyron, the chosen one. UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. They touch him up, and we are underway. You ready? You ready? Fight. All right, here we go. UFC welterweight championship is up for grabs right now. All right, so here we go with round one of this UFC welterweight championship fight. All eyes on the champion as he looks to defend the title yet again. Prior to his title reign, we saw this on the kick! Oh, look at this! Oh. Who saw that coming? Oh! He's got him hurt here. The champion is in big trouble here. He is in danger of losing his title. Now a right hand. Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable to that jab by almost leaning into it. Wow! He's in big, big trouble. Oh, he's going for it here. 
So in some trouble here, holds on, not doing a whole lot, just trying to recover here, Joe. Now goes in and secures the takedown. And there's one leg over. He's almost mounted him here. Looks he's like got he he's mounted him. here, Joe. He's got the arm here. Now he's gonna throw his leg over. It looks like he's got the arm bar locked up. It's very close here. Throw the leg over the face. More and more pressure on that arm. He might have to tap. And Stunning. Will Stunning. Do it. And he really made it look easy. Who's better? Who's better? Who's better? Who's better ever? Nobody. Yeah, that is high-level stuff out of him there, Joe, to finish the submission. It's one thing to get the dominant position. It's another thing to close the show, and he certainly did that here tonight. That's a big one. And here's the end of the fight. He does this. Look, he throws him through the air, catches the arm while he's on his way down, and traps the arm bar. Look at that. I mean, in the air, transitions to an armbar. Who does that? And ladies and gentlemen, there he is, a man that needs no introduction, the undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, and your winner tonight by way of spectacular submission. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop for this contest. At two minutes, eight seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out. And still, the undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Thailand, the chosen one, Woodley. So on the strength of a win by submission here tonight, he remains the UFC's undisputed welterweight champion. And not sure if he's brought to tears here in the corner, Joe, but they are celebrating and embracing this was a tough fight for them. It was a difficult training camp, a most worthy number one contender. And finally now, after defending the belt and getting the finish,